Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we got this HP laptop, the model 530, that I bought on a flea market for just 5 heroes. Yes, just 5 heroes. At this price, I simply can't resist. And as you can see, the condition isn't the best. Full of marks, full of scratches, faded paint, all over the place. Beside all these problems, is also missing the charger and hard disk. On top of that, the keyboard is also in really bad condition, missing some of keys, and the LCD isn't cracked but has a really really big scratch right in the middle. However, beside this bad luck, I made some tests and this computer is still working. So, when I look to this laptop, I think it deserves a second chance. Today we're gonna restore, upgrade and transform this laptop into something different with a super low budget. Stick around. First, as always, let's disassemble all the parts. And with all the disassembled parts done, we can now start the artwork. First, let's wash all the plastic parts to get them ready for the next step.
The wash is done, let's move on and start prep the plastics for some paint. In the better areas, a little scuff and it's done. For the worst parts, we're gonna need to sand them down to get the best finish possible. Now for the paint, the first color will be red, let's apply a couple coats and move on. Red is done, now a couple coats of black and we're done. Now, of course while the paint's still drying, let's start the cleaning the rest of the internal components. Meanwhile, of course, we're gonna apply some fresh thermal paste to keep this laptop cool.
after searching in my junk pile, I managed to find a replacement keyboard and also an LCD. So let's give them a quick clean and move on. For the LCD, I often ask what I use to clean and in this case and always I use a mix of glass cleaner and isopropyl alcohol. With all the clean done and the paint fully dry, let's move on to the final step of this paint. Let's make some decals, apply them and make a slightly different laptop. With the decals applied, let's spray a super light coat of red in the top of the black and create a super cool effect. And finally, we have all ready to reassemble this laptop and see the final result. So, without further ado, let's start.
For the RAM, I will add an extra 2GB stick that I also find in my junk pile, so this laptop has now 3GB of RAM. For the hard disk is the same story, a user one, 160GB that I have laying around will do the job. As I don't have the original support, I will use a small piece of foam to stick the disk into its place. For the final, the HP logo. is isn't the bridges and the straight one, but it's the only one I can find to fit the hole, so it will do. And finally, we're done. Power on, Linux Peppermint installed, and we're ready to go. Let's see how it looks. In the end, this color combo came out really really nice. That light red spray over the black gave this laptop a super cool effect. The Spider-Man inspiration theme also resulted very well. Simple, but cool. Isn't for sure the best and the quickest laptop in the world, but you can still use it for basic tests. In fact, this video script was written on this laptop. You can do other things like browsing, uh, YouTube and so on. So in the end, I think this laptop worth the effort. So as always, I hope you enjoy another restoration project. If you want to see more, please consider subscribe, leave a like, comment and also share this video. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.